I want to get the Requiem armor set, but I don't know where to start. Take it easy, sit back and take your pen. We will tell you everything you have to do to get the Requiem armor set. You can get your Requiem armor set by completing the Convergence of Sorrow 1, Elegy, and the Convergence of Sorrow 2, Requiem. To complete those achievements, you need 440 lump of mistoniums which is the currency of the Jahai Bluff map. You also need some of these materials to get the Requiem armor set. 40 Orakalcum ingot, 40 Cured Hardened Leather Square, 40 Bolt of Gossamer, 20 Ancient Wood Plank, 100 Glob of Ectoplasm, 45 Watchwork Sprocket, 30 Pile of Crystalline Dust, 25 Superior Sigil of Nullification, 20 Amalgamated Gemstone, 2 Swim Speed Infusion, 3,782 Volatile Magic, and a Heart of Destroyer. All of these materials are available for purchase at the trading post for 70 gold. Except for the Volatile Magic, which you must farm on LS4 maps, and the Heart of the Destroyer, which you may obtain by interacting with the Heart of the Destroyer on Mount Maelstrom, near Maelstrom's core. Before you begin, you can gather all of the necessary ingredients except the Lump of Mistonium. While completing some aspects of the achievement that do not need a Lump of Mistonium, you can farm it while finishing some parts of the achievement that doesn't need a Lump of Mistonium. Now let's talk about the first achievement, the Convergence of Sorrow 1, Elegy. There are 20 collections you need to gather. Looks like a complicated collection. But actually, it is easier than it looks. You can complete it in around one hour. Let's discuss them one by one. Amira's Lament. Speak with Amira at the northwest corner of Sun's Refuge. She has a map icon that says collection available. Unreadable words. Interact with the Ruin Memorial northwest of the Venta Pass Waypoint. Field notes on wrecked memorials. Approach Eladar northwest of the Venta Pass Waypoint, you'll find her chopping down a monument with an axe. Amira's complaint. Return to Amira in Sun's Refuge. Notes on a Sun Spear. Speak with Second Spear Riot at Riot's post in the Rylan River area and to the east of Reclaimed Chantry Waypoint. Further notes on a Sun Spear. There's a marked Sun Spear behind Riot. Listen to their conversation, wait for the dialogue to finish, and for the Sun Spear to show you the location of Eladar's house on the world map. Child's Toy. Interact with the Toy Roller Beetle to the west of the ruined Procession Vista, on the roof of the house below. Portrait of a Wife. In the house below, a faded portrait lies against the wall. Harsh words. Head southeast back towards the entrance to the sun's refuge, Eladar will be at Mirza's rest. Commission. Return to Amira in the sun's refuge. Memorial for a soldier. Purchase an awakened memorial from Amira using 20 oracalcum ingots. Travel to and repair the ruined memorial in Wormhaven, west of Wormarshal's encampment. Then return to Amira to purchase the next memorial. Memorial for a laborer. Purchase an awakened memorial from Amira using 20 cured hardened leather squares. Travel to and repair the ruined memorial in Yatendi village, northwest of the Yatendi village waypoint. Then return to Amira to purchase the next memorial. Memorial for a friend. Purchase an awakened memorial from Amira using 20 bolts of gossamer. Travel to and repair the ruined memorial in Crescent's Prosperity, halfway between the Crescent's Prosperity and Prosperity's approach map text, under a tree on the west side. Then return to Amira to purchase the next memorial. Memorial for a Peacemaker. Purchase an awakened memorial from Amira using 20 ancient wood planks. Travel to and repair the ruined memorial in Reclaimed Chantry, beneath the vista, inside the Chantry. Then return to Amira to purchase the next memorial. Memorial for a Wanderer. Purchase an awakened memorial from Amira using 20 oracalcum ingots. Travel to and repair the ruined memorial in Almora's stand, directly east of staging platform. Then return to Amira to purchase the next memorial. Memorial for a brother. Purchase an awakened memorial from Amira using 20 cured hardened leather squares. Travel to and repair the ruined memorial in Central Brand Scar, just south of Monument to the return of Palawa Joko. Then return to Amira to purchase the next memorial. Memorial for a wife and son. Purchase an awakened memorial from Amira using 20 bolts of gossamer. Travel to and repair the ruined memorial in Venta Pass, northwest of the Venta Pass Waypoint. Invitation. Talk to Eladar, near Soul's Vendetta Waypoint. Convergence.
Return to the ruined memorial northwest of Venta Pass Waypoint. Endings and beginnings. Return to Amira in the Sun's Refuge. After the convergence of Sorrow 1, Elegy is complete, you will receive a box of Elegy armor as a reward. In this box contain Elegy armor. You can choose what prefix to this armor. If you have completed all collections, then we will move on to the next discussion, the Convergence of Sorrow 2, Requiem. There are 21 collections you need to gather. Because you need Lump of Mistonium Quiet a lot. You cannot complete this achievement in one day. Perhaps you can complete it in 4 to 5 days. Just remember do not miss your daily gathering of Lump of Mistonium. Let's discuss them one by one. Story of a Jin. Complete the event Defeat the Branded Jin Vemian, this event chain starts in the confluence of the elements. Then talk to Zia the Radiant in Sun's Refuge, and choose the second dialogue option. Empty Jin Bottle. Complete the event Find the Jin Vessel before the Brandstorm overwhelms the area near the Ancestor Tree, then talk to Vemian who will appear by the tree. A Desperate Need. After getting the Empty Jin Bottle, talk to Micah. Box of Gift Armor. Talk to Amira in Sun's Refuge. Note of Receipt. Speak to Micah again. You need to take a note here, she only spawns during the Jin phase of the Ancestor Tree meta. She can only be talked to if the find the Jin vessel, before the brandstorm overwhelms the area is successful. Otherwise, she is present, but it is not possible to interact with her. Family Histories, Volume 1. Complete the event Prevent Brand Energy from Overwhelming the Area Near the Ancestor Tree, then talk to Nuri. Family Histories, Volume 2. Talk to Noorama, during the Aboga Shift of the Ancestor Tree. Mist Entangled Item. Kill a Branded Rift Stalker. Armorsmith is Hallmark. Return to Amira in Sun's Refuge. Research Proposal. Travel to the Derman Priory in Lorner's Pass, walk to the Hero Point, and then enter the Derman Priory instance. Talk to Ely Scorchfire inside. Historic Boots. Find Ely again in Hidden Arcana to unlock a new collection, Requiem, Experiment 1, and then complete it by purchasing Demystifying Device, then interacting with the two nearby objects the Curiously Empty Bezel, and the Glowing Red Button. Mist Entangled Item. Buy this from Shadow's Agent Keto in the Reclaimed Chantry. Historic Leggings. Find Ely to unlock a new collection, Requiem, Experiment 2. Buy the items the demystifying device and the additional spectrum filter and repeat the process above. Mist Entangled Item. Buy this from Village Head Azzy in Yutendi Village. Historic Gloves. Speak to Ely to unlock a new collection, Requiem, Experiment 3. Buy her items and repeat the process above. Mist Entangled Item. Buy this from Warmaster Steelburn in Pact Vanguard. Historic Shoulders. Speak to Ely to unlock a new collection, Requiem, Experiment 4. Buy her items and repeat the process above. Mist Entangled Item. Buy this from Trader Hyacinth in Yutendi Village. Historic Headgear. Speak to Ely to unlock a new collection, Requiem, Experiment 5. Buy her items and repeat the process above. Mist Entangled Item. Defeat the Death Branded Shatterer. Historic Chest. Speak to Ely to unlock a final new collection, Requiem, Experiment 6. Buy her items and repeat the process above. After the Convergence of Sorrow 2, Requiem is complete, you will get one set of Requiem armor by opening 6 of the historic chest that you get along with completing the achievement. If you want to get another set of Requiem armor, you can buy it on Trader Hyacinth. Another full set of Requiem armor costs 375 Lump of Mistonium and 75 Blob of Ectoplasm. I think I need to start as soon as possible. Thank you for this guide. You're welcome. That's it for today's video. Comment below with what you want to know. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to our channel for more informative content about MMOs.